Good morning. All right, y'all, so it is the weekend. It is Friday. Technically, it's the weekend because we don't have class today. I am just making some breakfast right now. I'm making waffles and eggs and all that jazz. I figured I should make an actual proper breakfast while I have the time. And yeah, I was like, you know what? Today is a beautiful day. I think I'm gonna vlog a little bit. So right now, I'm about to make these eggs and eat these waffles and maybe watch a little bit of Netflix and yeah, plan my day, figure out what I'm going to be doing, what I'm going to be, um, what I want to achieve today. So I hope you guys are doing well. I hope you guys are having a fabulous day yourselves, um, that your day is off to a great start. And yeah, I'm just in a really good mood right now. The sun is shining, the windows are open, everything is beautiful. Yes, we thank God. making my breakfast this is what we are working with and you know it's just a little something um, strawberries waffles eggs and avocados so I'm gonna go ahead and eat this and maybe watch some Netflix as well and then we'll go ahead and figure out what we're doing for the rest of the day all right y'all so I finished eating and I went ahead and did my makeup because I know I'm about to leave the house so let me do that. And it's the weekend. I want to look nice. I want to look put together because I haven't worn makeup in a long period of time. Also, last time y'all saw me, I was eating and I was actually on the phone with Uche. Um, Uche, she has a channel on here, Uche Dior. She's my very, very good friend. You guys should check out her channel. I'm going to link it down below. So you definitely have to watch and subscribe. But yes, I was on the phone with her. So while I was on the phone, I was like, let me just go ahead and do my makeup too. So like I said, I need to figure out what I'm doing today. And as I was sitting here, you know, eating my waffles, I realized, you know, I'm gonna decorate my apartment. I think I'm going to spend today getting a few extra stuff for my room and putting that together. Um, because in the last vlog, I was just saying that I, I really wanted to make my room like comfortable and just like a space that I really love and enjoy. So yeah, I think I'm going to go to TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Ross, and um, see what I can find. But I'm going to write down a little bit of a list so that I can have an idea of what I want. So when I was in the store recently, I saw a mirror. Let me tell you all. I saw a mirror that I wanted to put in the actual apartment. Um, so I'm gonna write that down, so mirror. And it was a round mirror. So I wanna put it at the end of our hall so that you know, when we're leaving, we can just kind of like look, make sure we look decent and then leave the house, you know? So mirror, um, I wanna get two paintings for my room. So if y'all watch um, Aaliyah's face on YouTube, I love her. She showed us how to basically like get like really nice paintings for the low and I got them from Etsy from the same place that she got hers. Got them from Etsy. You can download the, the, the file and then print them out at like Kinko's or wherever. And you know, print them out, get a picture frame and hang them up and there you go, you got paintings for a fraction of the price. So I'm gonna do that today. I already downloaded it to my phone so I'm hoping I can get that printed and everything done today. So two paintings, um, palm tree. I wanted to get like some sort of like palm, species in my room. I wanted um, a fake one. I probably could have done a real one because you know having like live plants in your room is good like for oxygen and all that stuff but my room like the lighting in there is kind of dark like the window placement is actually kind of terrible so I don't think anything any any life organism would survive <laughs> in my room. Um, so I'll just get like a fake one and I saw a couple at Hobby Lobby that I want to get so we'll go there too and Oh my ring light. So I ordered a ring light. 
actually from Amazon the other day and it finally came in, but they attempted to deliver it at the apartment, but I, I don't know, the attempt didn't go through and they have it at the post office now and I'm getting a late start to the day, but it's 3.11, the post office closes at five, so I'll probably do that first. So ring light and yeah, probably some more decorative pillows. We'll see where the spirit leads me. Um, Okay, so I'm just gonna jump into the car now and start heading to that side of town. Okay, you know what makes me laugh, guys? Let me put y'all down a second. Okay, you know what kind of makes me laugh? I definitely have like all this lip product on that I'm about to hide with this mask. But are y'all like that? Like, if you were to wear makeup, like, would you still wear like lip product even though you're gonna be wearing a mask? I think I'm one of those kind of girls where I'll just, I'll still wear my lip product because it just, it just completes the look. I don't feel like I'm complete without it. So, yes, let's go ahead and head out. Um, I actually know my way around, guys. I'm really happy about that. Um, don't really need the GPS as much because I only go to three places anyway. Um, not even, really, really one place, which is the grocery store, really. That's the only reason I'm leaving the house. Okay, so I just got back from the post office and I got my package, yay! Um, it was really big, really, really big. So I guess I see why they couldn't drop it at the house or at the apartment. But y'all, I wanna tell you guys a little story as I drive to Marshall's. So my name is Elizabeth Smart, as you as you know. Um, and it's, I don't know if you, you guys know, cause this happened so many years ago. So I don't know how popular the story is, but there was a girl who got kidnapped in 2001 with the same name, Elizabeth Smart. And it's just crazy how to this day, to this very day, at the grown age of 24, when she got kidnapped, I was six, I'm 24. To this day, that never escapes me. No matter where I go, I always have like one encounter of, oh, aren't you, like, don't you, don't you have the same name as that girl? like? that has, you know, that got kidnapped. It's crazy, when I was younger, my cousin was even scared that I was even the one that got kidnapped. Like when he kept seeing my name on the news, he was like, oh my God, did Elizabeth get kidnapped? But no, y'all, it was a whole different person. But it's just so crazy how we have the exact name like that. But um, when I was at the post office, he was like, don't you have like that name? Like your name is also Elizabeth Smart. Like, like that girl, like she got kidnapped. Like that's so crazy. I'm like, yes. The fun part, the fun quirky thing is, <laughs> If you could call it quirky. But the fun thing is, is I actually got to meet her, actually. Um, she came to AM uh, a couple of years back for a book tour. And yeah, she came. She had just written a book. And I got to meet her and everything. And I was like, girl, we got the same name. And um, I feel like I've been your little shadow all my life. Um, but yeah, she was like, what? That's so crazy. Like, she had never met another Elizabeth Smart before. And it was just really interesting to actually meet the real Elizabeth Smart. Like, not that I'm not the real Elizabeth Smart. Like, I'm real too, right? Okay? But you know what I mean? Like, that's, that's her. That's, that's the girl. That's crazy. But yeah, she seemed nice when I met her. Um, you know, very nice and well-spoken. And yeah, I, I didn't buy her book or anything. I didn't read it. <laughs> Um, but I'm sure it was good. I'm sure it was well written. Um, but yeah, just a little fun fact with y'all. Okay, so I finally... So... This is what I'm looking at. And... Okay, I think this is the size and the look of what I want. Uh -huh, 24 by 36. This is what I want. Cause I think this is huge. Yeah. But I take this out. Yeah, I think I like this size, and I like the frame itself. Like the actual frame is nice. It's just black. I'm just gonna leave that there, and then let me see what else I have. I think this is the same. Is that? Oh, this is 20 by 30. 20 by 30. I'm trying to remember what she had in her video. Okay, 
So I just watched her video again where I, got, I forwarded to the exact clip that she mentioned the size and she said 24 by 30 is what she got. So I think I may just do, I, I, they don't have a 24 by 30 here. This one is 20 by 30 and I don't know, something about it just looks so small. But then this just looks so big too. Oh, this is 24 by 36. 24 by 36. 24 by, how is this 24 by 36? Oh, I guess the frame is like smaller. The frame is smaller so it makes it smaller. And now I'm like, what the heck? Do I like the frame of this or the frame of that? You know what, y'all? I'm gonna call my sister. <laughs> I'm gonna call my sister and then I will figure out what I'm doing. I don't know why my GPS doesn't know directions. I really don't know why. But anyway, um, I think I'm gonna get, obviously I'm in the car now, I've left Hobby Lobby, um, and I think I'm gonna get 24 by 36 and just get two of those, but I will not be making my purchase from Hobby Lobby. Thank you, but no thanks, because $59.99 is kind of expensive. Um, you know, like the whole point of doing this is to save money, and if the frame is just as expensive as it would have been if I just bought the painting, then I might as well just bought the painting. My sister wisely suggested that I just, you know, Google it and search up if they have them at Walmart and Target and the rest, and they actually have one at Target, like literally in store right now. So I'm gonna go to Office Depot, get the paintings printed, and then come back over here because the Target is literally like right next to Hobby Lobby. And let me hold you, make sure you don't fall. Um, come back to Target, buy the frames, and I'm hoping I can find a palm tree in there too. Because I know the, the Target in my, um, in Houston had a lot of like home decor plant things. So I hope this one will have something. Because again, I just really feel like, I don't know why I really was playing myself. Like Hobby Lobby is consumer friendly. We all know that that's not true. Hobby Lobby is very expensive. Very, very expensive. And the palm trees that I saw there were very expensive too. But I mean, if, if that's the only one I can find, I'm not gonna lie, on Amazon they were kind of expensive as well. But if if that's the only way I can find, then I guess I'll just get it. I mean, it'll be okay. But yeah, yeah. I hope printing these paintings won't be too expensive either. I don't know. I didn't even really like switch it up. I don't know why I'm really acting like Google is not a thing. My sister's calling. Hello. Hey girl. Hello. Hey. Okay, so I am in. Target now and I found the frames but they don't have 24 by 30 in the black that I want it's only gold like this and if it was even silver it would work because that's like the color scheme of my room um, black and silver like black and gray I mean so the silver could have worked but I don't know I'm hoping that I can ask somebody and maybe they'll have some in the back or I will just have to maybe go to another store. I feel like if Target has a bunch, then Walmart's probably gonna have a bunch too. All right, so I'm not even gonna bother taking off my mask because the store that I'm going to is like right next door. But I could not find the frames at Target. Um, as y'all saw, they were the ones in gold and I'm looking for some in black. So I'm optimistic that I'll just find them at Walmart. I'm not looking for anything with too much you know pizzazz i just want like a black frame um so i'm sure i'll find it at walmart but for now i'm just gonna move on to the rest of my list and try to look for the other decor items i was looking for all right so i am in tj maxx now and i am approaching the mirror that i was telling you guys about here it goes here i am this is what i'm wearing today <laughs> but yes this is the mirror and just thank God for TJ Maxx prices, because I even saw a, a mirror like this similar, um, a similar mirror to this in Target, and it was like $60, so wonderful. So I think I'm gonna get one of these and hang it up where I said it. Okay, y'all, I ain't even gonna lie to you. I am very tired. 
and I feel like I was in that Walmart for approximately seven years because oh child the line was so long I haven't bought the palm tree I haven't bought the palm tree and I don't know I'm, I'm really contemplating like do I need the palm tree like do I really need it I don't know I don't know but I want it you know like I really want it <laughs> like I don't need it but I want it but I want it so I don't know I'm just hungry now I have no idea what to eat I kind of want to eat out you know get a little something something I don't know I'm kind of craving Thai food I don't know if they have Thai food out here though I just got to Happy Lobby and I am in the fake plant section let me show y'all what I'm looking at there we go so I'm kind of like wondering about this guy and honestly I don't really like the print of these leaves. I don't know, like I'm weird about it, but I prefer something more like this, like a darker color than this. And this one's also nice too. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know. It's like I'd rather something a little bit more like grand and these like, Leaves are very thin. But yeah, I don't know. This one or this one. And this is an automatic no, so I might as well just put her back. I'm just so shook. Like, you really can't bend these. I don't know. I mean, like, I don't know why I had that impression that you could do that. Like, I thought you could fold it out like this. Anyway. So y'all already know I'm about to call my sister because, you know, I can't make decisions to save my life. Um, and we'll see what she advises. All right, so we are done. Thank God. <sighs> I'm so tired, but I got the palm tree. Y'all can see it in the back there. <sighs> Girl, I, I don't know if I'm gonna set everything up tonight. We'll see if my food rejuvenates me. I'm able to re unwind enough. Maybe I'll find the energy to do it. But if not, I may just set everything up tomorrow. Just first thing in the morning, just start setting stuff up. I got the command strips at Hobby Lobby 2. I'm sure I spent like $20 more than I needed to. It wasn't $20, but still, Hobby Lobby is very overpriced, but I just could not get myself to go anywhere else to buy those command strips. I just need to get it all done there so I can be done, like done, done. So I was able to get my Thai food though. I placed an order for it a little while ago, so I'm sure it's done now. So I'm gonna go get that. And I'm gonna watch when I get home. Kissing Booth, the Kissing Booth 2. It just came out today and whew, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I know when I sit down and eat my food, watch my movie, it's gonna be it's gonna be a good evening. It's gonna be a good evening. So yeah, I'm gonna go get that. And yeah. We'll see. I mean, if you, if the next clip is me setting things up, then just know that I was able to get my energy back. But if it's the next morning, just know that your girl was really tired. But yes, today was a long day. I'm glad to be done. And yeah. Good morning. So as you can see, it is the next day. I wasn't able to muster up enough energy to come back and you know, get things set up. I just, I was too tired. I was too tired. But I did um, get my food and I watched The Kissing Booth 2. Great movie. Great movie. Um, I really, really liked it. I'm going to take out my hair. Okay, yes. I really, really, really liked that movie. Um, it was really long, like two hours long. So, um, I am in my room. It is the morning, obviously. And... I woke up, talked to my sister, and now I'm about to start with this room. So, it's kind of, it's not as organized right now. Just the bed. And I, I have some stuff over here on the side. I wanted to take that off to really, like, give myself a clean slate to see if I could find anything else at the store that I want to replace. But 
I wasn't able to find anything and I think I like what I already have. I think I'll just use that. I think I'm going to hang up or get the paintings situated. And yeah, I'm gonna transfer y'all over to my tripod so you guys can see as I do that. And I really hope it looks good. Like I really, really hope it looks good. Okay, so I got the frame and I have the, the paintings and I asked for the cheapest version um that I can get I just I just don't want to spend too much on paper so let's just see how this is looking and I mean it's black and white I don't think it can really be that messed up let's see okay I'm trying to hold all the corners down with something but yeah this is what we're working with and it doesn't look too shabby let's go ahead and open her up and put her in I have to get my command strips let me grab those from the kitchen and then yeah oh lord <laughs> I don't know why I'm nervous okay <laughs> let me go ahead and do that This looks wonderful and seven dollars for the print and yeah 16 14 for the frame so all of that in total is less than $25 for this painting and I guarantee you if you were to go anywhere else you would not be spending $25 for something like this at this size all right so I'm done with both of them and they're looking very cute sitting over there um, I got the command strips um, uh, yes, I got the command strips. They hold up to 24 by 36. That's my size, so hopefully we won't have any problems and these won't be falling down in the middle of the night, right? Okay. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you that was very hard um i'm sweating trying to get the paintings up there right now the instructions said that i have to let the command strips like sit in the wall for an hour so i'm gonna do that i'm gonna go eat i'm hungry and hopefully by the time i'm done it'll be an hour and i can hang these up and move on to the rest of the room i don't know if i would recommend these command strips y'all i know like apartment living like you don't really want to like put in too many nails into the wall but I've done it before and the world never like the world didn't end so if I was to do it again I'd probably just put a nail on the wall and call it a day <laughs> um, but yeah I'm gonna go eat and then I'll be right back all right so I ate and I actually had a quick zoom meeting in between two so it has been well over an hour um, I'm gonna go ahead and put these back up and hopefully they will stay up Lord have mercy all right, so I don't know, what do y'all think? Like, it's done, and I, I like the look of it. It doesn't look bad. Um, I flipped them, so as you can see, like, they're not on the same side. Like, they're, they're not the exact same image on each side. I don't know if y'all can notice that. But I flipped it like that to add some variety, some change, some, like, difference between the two. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and make the rest of this bed. <laughs> All 
Alright, so the bed is made and I just added the two pillows. I have no idea where I got those pillows from, honestly. I think maybe Home Goods, like a little while back. And I just added this like gray blanket here. I don't know if you can see that. The gray blanket on the side. So, yeah, so I'm, I'm really liking how this is looking. So as you can see, I added flowers to the ends of um, the bed, like on the side tables. And I like the touch, like I like that. Um, I kind of want to add like maybe like two lamps as well or maybe just like one big lamp or like something because the lights in this room are quite bright and a lot of times we just don't need all that light, you know? We don't really need all that light. So, oh I forgot this. I have this E that my friend Quan got me. So I'm going to add that here. I just like having it here. And yeah, so we're gonna add that um, in the corner. You can't even really see it, but it's there. I also have another E over there too, it's a black one. So I'm gonna go ahead and bring in the palm tree. I'm gonna see where it's gonna fit. We'll see if it even, if it even fits in the room or makes sense with the room, but. All right, so I added the palm tree to the corner of the room and I'm just gonna turn on the light so it can be a little bit more illuminated in here. But I like it, I like it. Especially when I come back into the room, I like the way it looks. Like I like the green, this is a little bit of vegetation, you know? Yeah, I'm happy with the way that this looks. And you know, this is not gonna be the last way that the room will look, if that makes sense. Like I will probably redecorate every so often. I plan on staying in this space for a little while anyway. So it's not forever and I like the way it looks right now. So yeah, I'm so happy. Let me come back to the front of the camera. <sighs> All right, so I I finished. It was a long time coming. Um, I'm gonna hang up that mirror eventually, but I just realized that that um, command strip is just, it's not it. It's not it. I think I may, if there's gonna be any sacrifice, you know, where I have to like use a nail, I think it'll be for that because a mirror is just too, too fragile to be playing games. And even these paintings, I'm kind of, I'm just praying they won't fall in the middle of the night. <laughs> I'm praying. But yeah, I, yeah, I'm really happy. This was, this was a long weekend. It was a long weekend, but I'm really glad I got to vlog most of it. Ah, <laughs> I'm really glad I got to vlog most of it and just have y'all with me during this sleepy, rainy weekend. It's raining now, and y'all, they say there's like a hurricane coming or whatever, and <laughs> I don't know. I don't know about all that. Um, it's okay. I think right about now, I think I'm just gonna chill in my bed, um, edit some essays for my friend, maybe watch a movie. Yeah, I'm just gonna relax the rest of this evening. And then, oh, another thing, I wanna set up my, my ring light. So, <sighs> yeah, I'm not even gonna bother even vlogging that process. Hopefully it won't be a hard setup. But I'm gonna set my ring light, and I'm really excited about that because I've been wanting to get a ring light for a long time. Let me tell y'all, let me put y'all on. I never had a ring light before. If you click through some of my videos, like there's a couple videos that I have, like it's just like a white background and a light. That was not a ring light. What I did, and this is a little bit of like DIY, like on the low, I would just go to Walmart and I would get like a regular regular lamp, a regular regular lamp that you can just like turn and face towards you. And I would just put a white light in there because at the end of the day, like ring lights are just white lights. Like I think that's why people just appreciate it because it's a white clear light and it, it um, imitates daylight a lot better than like yellow light or anything like that. So. I'll just put a white light bulb in there and I will get that ring light effect. Ooh, <laughs> my door definitely just opened on its own. It does that when the AC turns off. <laughs> but yeah, so I just put the white bulb in there and it would give me the look of a ring light for the low, for the low. So if you're starting your YouTube channel too and you don't really feel like taking the plunge and buying a ring light, um, I would just say get a lamp, any regular lamp and put a white light in there. So that is pretty much it, y'all. I'm just gonna let y'all go here. But thank you guys so much for watching this. I'm just gonna start editing this video like maybe in the next like week or two, but hopefully it won't be too long. If it is long and you're all the way at the very end, you're a real one. 
we appreciate you. Thank you so much. Yeah, so go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video.